Hey, hey, it's Rishi. Welcome to Modern Trinidadian Food. Today, we're going to make a classic Trini Christmas drink, sorrel. So sorrel is just your traditional Trini Christmas drink. It's kind of like Christmas in a glass. When you have it, you kind of just go, ah, it's Christmas. It's actually made from the flowers of the sorrel tree. And today I'm going to show you guys uh, a recipe of how we make sorrel in Trinidad. So let's get to it. To make this drink, you're going to need the dried sorrel uh, flowers. And you can find these in almost any uh, Trini grocery or, or supermarket. And they're just dried uh, sorrel flowers. You can also use a fresh one, but for the simplest recipe that I'm making today, it's better just to use and it's easier just to use the um, dried uh, sorrel flowers. You're going to need some sugar, cinnamon stick, clove, star anise, ginger. Of course, you're going to need some water. And in the end, we're going to flavor it up with some bitters and some orange extract. The recipe is available at www.moderntrinidadianfood.com and today we're going to make one liter of sorrel. So let's put this all together. We're going to put all the ingredients except for the bitters and the orange extract into a pot and then we're just going to boil it. Water. So we have all the ingredients in the pot. We're just going to give it a stir. And then we're going to put it on the stove and we're going to boil this for 10 minutes. So what we're going to do, we're going to bring this to a boil and then we're going to let it go for 10 minutes. After that, we're going to just let it sit or steep for about five minutes. And then we're going to strain it and add the extract. It's that simple. So you can see it's coming up to a boil now. Now you don't want a really, really heavy boil. You just want it to be like this, a little bit more than a simmer, but not a crazy big heavy rolling boil. Turn the heat down to like a medium. And I just want it to just gently boil like this. It's been about 10 minutes. So now we're just gonna take it off the heat, turn the stove off, and we're gonna let it sit for five minutes. It's been brewing for about five minutes. So now we're just going to strain it. Pour it through a strainer. And just be slow and gentle because it is still hot. Then you can just press down the flowers, the petals, just to squeeze out that extra juju. And now what we're going to do, we're just going to let this sit here like this and cool down for about two or three hours. After it's uh, cooled down, now you can just add the bitters and the orange extract and just give it a stir. Pouring it in there, give it a stir. And now you can bottle it or put it into a pitcher. You could wind up with less than a liter and that's just because you can't exactly control how much water actually boils off uh, while it's boiling for those 10 minutes. Um, if it does come up a little bit short, you can just add a little bit of room temperature water to bring it back up to one liter and that's perfectly fine. So now that we've got it bottled, the next step is just to put it in the fridge and leave it overnight. And then after that, just serve it chilled. Just to be a bit fancy, you can serve it up in a uh, garnish glass. So maybe a little sugar rim, some crushed ice, maybe a little lemon wheel, the lime wedge, like so, and just pour a nice serving. And there you have it. Cheers. Merry Christmas.